Hey guys, this is a mix of stuff. I hope everybody out there is doing well. Um, I just thought I would start this video. Um, it's, a, you know, like I said, a mix of stuff. But I figured I would start from the end and work backwards. Uh, this is something that I experienced this morning, but I've experienced it frequently. Now, a lot of us have incontinence, let's face it. But... <sighs> Do you ever go to the bathroom and it's like you're just sitting there like you've got a lazy bladder and it seems like it's taking you seven minutes. Well, maybe not that long. It's taking you like four or five minutes to like empty your bladder and then after you do, you end up with pains under your rib cage from it. I was just curious if anybody else experienced that. Um, I ended up coming back to bed, and I laid here for a little bit, and I'm like, ow. But, yeah, I just figured I would toss that one out there. So, on to the rest of the video clips. Holy shit, guys. I have this thing where I sit in the car, and I think it touches <coughs> the vertebrae in my back or something where the lesions are. And... I can't handle the light right now. I start getting like a flare up. And I've been in the car for, I don't know, an hour now. My legs are stiffening up, my hands are stiffening up. I'm white as a friggin' ghost. Um, I can't even wear my glasses, they're annoying my head. I tried the tapping thing. And that's really cool. I guess as far as the anxiety goes, but I, I can't even handle the friggin' light right now. I want to go and close myself in a closet. I'm sure you guys have been here and through this crap to experience it, to know what I'm saying. Instant headache with flare-up. Instant. Instantaneous. I can even barely hold this up. My hands are too weak to, like, hold a stupid phone up. Holy crap. So, that is how my Friday, March 31st, is going. Can only get better, right? Oh, goodness, guys. I may have mentioned in the past about food allergies and eggs. And, well, I never had a problem with fresh eggs from Roger's parents' house. And just now, I started eating some eggs. And all of a sudden, I felt like I was going to toss every cookie in my body my body started to feel weak, so I was just like, throw the egg away. Can't eat the egg today, which really stinks. It's just something. Every so often, I get an egg reaction. Now, my biological grandmother had problems with sulfur, and she couldn't eat eggs. I don't know, so, guys. It's going on 2 a.m., and I can't help but laugh because it's like, Bartonella turns us into a vampire. <laughs> really. Now, I crave red meat and I am miserable until I get it. And it's got to be rare, right? So, what about our sleep? First sunny day that central New York has had in forever. And that's the state. We're not talking about the city. I go out into the sunlight and it's like... <laughs> get in the truck to go for a ride have the windows open the roof open on top of the truck the sun beams down in my eyes and I jump to close the window quick and I shut the trap so no sunlight comes in and hits me in the face no wonder I'm white let's not forget about insomnia no 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 exhausted all day sleep all day and wide awake at night if you're ever itching to be a vampire, go get bit by a tick, a flea, a mosquito. You're sure to live the life of a vampire. <laughs> All right, guys. Thanks so much for watching. I am off to finally color up and touch up the roots that have some silver highlights in them. Let's hope my hair does not fall out from it. I hope everybody is doing good, and I love you guys. Don't let anybody dictate your mood. All right. Catch you soon.